Hey, 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 John here. Hope you're having a great day. Uh, the April Fool's edition of my channel. Thank you all for subscribing. Thank you for uh, liking it. 265,000 views. Uh, since it's April Fool's Day, I think we should uh, get a thousand subs. How's that? Let's go for a thousand. Or uh, I should change the name of the channel like uh, Potser Palace. John James Potser Palace. What do you think of that? Um, anyway, I, I hope you're having a great day. And uh, I saw the chess.com thing with uh, swiping right, swiping left, and laughed and laughed and laughed. So wanted to give a video out today to everybody. I do need subs. I, you know, appreciating the views. Uh, let's try to get this thing up to a thousand. I am still working on the descriptions because I got to do 188 left. And uh, I've been slacking because it's all like copy and paste, go to the thing, and then it goes to the top again. I got to go find the next video and do the same thing. But I am working on it. I'm uh, also considering taking up my uh, game videos I had uh, a while back, as well as uh, I don't have the site for kids. It's, you know, um, adults 18 and over, but allow 13 and up. And I'm not really sure if I want to change all the videos to um, it's okay for kids. I mean, the site is okay for kids. And uh, I just don't know if I want to have the comments uh, go off the hook. And there's, you know, I'm a 13, 1600 player. And so with these games, I mean, there's kids out there that are freaking masters. <laughs> so I just... Uh, I just put it out for the site, you know, what you're going to experience uh, as a 13 to 1600 playing dailies on chess.com. And we've been trying to get this chess club going in Lincoln City. We had a Newport uh, chess club called the Central Coast, Oregon Central Coast Chess Club. And I think about 20 years. And uh, they had the Newport open in June. And it was a beautiful place uh, you know, June on the Oregon coast is amazing. So, uh, beautiful place to go. A lot of Portland players, like a really good Portland players came down and we did quite well against them. I mean, we had an expert in the club and, um, a couple 1800s, few 1600s and, uh, we did really well. I mean, we took first and third in 2009. I took tied for third and, uh, then we had in 2010, uh, Jacob, who, he was a really good player. We were about the same level, 15, 1600, and all of a sudden he just excelled and just jumped on past me. And he beat a master from Portland, uh, European heritage. Um, guy was well known, I can't remember his name, I wish I could, but in 2010, Newport Open, uh, Jacob beat him. And, um, it was amazing. He won the tournament. So we had some players that could play. And there was a lot of players from Bend that would come over for that as well. And so uh, we had some great tournaments, great, great events. And then COVID and all this stuff and the, and the club disbanded. So uh, about in January, a friend of mine uh, posted that John James is one of the best players here in Lincoln County. And that's not true. I mean, I'm not bad, uh, but there are better players in Lincoln County. And uh, there's still some of the Newport club people. I was number two in the club for a long time. I got sick around 2011, 2012, and got AFib and that kind of thing. And uh, had the heart deal. So uh, it fell down at fourth in the club, but you know, I'm not bad. I'm really good over the board and I, and I played in some tournaments. So, you know, since high school and, and I was 1648 USCF then, and I think my card would be 1500, but he posted on, uh, Pioneer Joe coffee Company's uh, Facebook and they were thinking about getting a tournament. So they were asking if people would be interested in 
interested in the club. And they're just south of Lincoln City. So um, it's at Salishan. It's a big resort country club. I mean, it's real fancy. And there's a lot of businesses in that complex. And, you know, you got bakeries, uh, a club bar for the for the players. Then you've got a really high-end restaurant, really high-end, fancy. And then you've got the the coffee company and coffee shop. And you just got some really cool places to go. And it's an event to go there. I mean, there's there's a lot of things going on. You got music outside on one side of the complex, and then you got us chess players playing, you know, on Sundays and Tuesdays. And so anyway, they they uh, posted it on their post. Well, if he's so good, why doesn't he come and prove it? And so I was like, all right. So I I typed in. I go, well, uh, that's a challenge. And winky face. And uh, next thing I know, they had the tournament, and I actually won it. And so that was that was pretty fun. And that was about three weeks ago now. And I've been going every Sunday. I can't make Tuesdays. Uh, Tuesdays at 5, Sundays at 2. And if anybody's on the Oregon coast or near it, like Corvallis or whatever, um, come on down if you're a chess player, man. People are really cool there. Everybody helps everybody. Everybody plays everybody. And um, it's actually a lot of fun. And so uh, J.J. Near Justin, he uh, is the one that got this club going. And he just got accreditation for the club from the USCF. So uh, they're going to try to do potential chess tournaments here on the Central Oregon coast. Great thing for the coast, you know. Uh, if you want to go to a... You know, chess club or play chess, you got to go into the valley near I-5, you know, Salem, uh, Corvallis, Eugene, uh, Portland. And Portland, are, you know, have the big name players there. But uh, it's kind of sparse on the coast. So we've got about 14, 15 people right now, and we're trying to build it. And uh, they just got accredited, so they're going to come up with a... Uh, USCF tournament here, hopefully within a year, and uh, they've got some backers, so uh, they even threw around, I was talking to them uh, while I was eating dinner at the really nice restaurant, it's amazing, but uh, they were thinking $10,000 draw type of USCF tournament, if we can get it going, so there's going to be monthly tournaments now, and uh, they're 20 minute time on the clock and you've got, uh, uh, you know, seven or eight rounds. And then they're going to give, you know, hundred dollars for first, $50 for second. They've got gift certificates as well for first and second and then third. And so the local businesses are all for it and they've all decided to sponsor it, which is an amazing thing for everybody. So we're trying to get the chess club in. Uh, you see me play uh, JJ Near. If you're interested, contact him on chess.com and just send a message to JJ N E A R, JJ Near, and uh, he can give you the information. But uh, the uh, there's a couple of other players that are playing me from there, and then you know. Uh, the love of dailies, man, you get to play people from all over the world, you know, just played a Russian player, played a few Russian players, I, I've got a winning record against them, India, India is tough, I think I'm, I'm either one up or one down, I think, but um, Russia players are tough too, so, but you know, um, I'm doing really well against US players, man, I'm smoking them, most, for the most part, but I'm having fun, and I love dailies, and uh, it's just a great experience, and I hope you enjoyed this site, um, put some work into it, you know, like I said, I'm going to get the rest of the descriptions done so that they're on the videos, and uh, I'm kind of thinking of uh, taking out the games that I used to play, and, uh, and just making it total chess, uh, what do you guys think? And please comment. 
I mean, you know, don't be scared. I don't bite too much, you know. I played some hockey back when I was 44 to 50, so, you know, I might go. But uh, I think, you know, just make some good comments. And, uh, you know, if you if you got some ideas, that'd be great. And if you like the games, that's great. If you don't like the games, say why, you know. But let's have some fun with this thing. Let's get some subs. Let's share it. Share it. it you know, I... Uh, I do this for the love of the game, and I really enjoy chess.com. I think it's an amazing, uh, amazing venue, and as well as the analysis. I love the analysis, and it's the only app that I have with chess. Man, I don't have Stockfish. I don't have all that stuff. Maybe I should. Maybe I'd be a better player, but I ain't going to cheat. And I started when I was 11. Now I'm almost 68, so... You know, I know my ability. I know that, you know, what you see is what you get. And I do the best I can. And, uh, you know, I just try to make a fun chess site. And I hope you like it. Please subscribe. Please share. Please like. And uh, you have a great day. Happy April Fool's Day. You know, let's change this name to Potser Palace. Have a great one. Bye.